Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for clicking on this video. If you do not know, my name is Poya Sak. Thank you for clicking on my video and coming to my channel. Today I am giving you a fall. Guys, right now in Texas it's really not that fall is still hot, but we're getting there. We must get into the spirits no matter what. So let's just get right into it. So I already did my brows off camera. If you are not aware of how I do my brows, the products that I always use, I always use the same products. Go ahead and click on the card up here so you can watch my brows and mascara video. It gives you all the rundown on everything that I do. But for this look, I'm just going to go ahead and start. For today's look, I'm going to be starting off by using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Eye Makeup Primer. Alright, I am looking very ghost-like. That is what we like. We like a little... So, the first thing that I do on my eyes... I know that you guys have, I know that some of you have watched a lot of my other eyeshadow videos. I just tried to blend out that color with a eyeshadow that's the same color as my skin tone, but yeah. Anyways, how have you guys been feeling this fall? You know, how have you guys been feeling during this new season of Halloween, Thanksgiving coming around and everything? I am definitely, I am definitely one of those people that's kind of like, forget Columbus, like let's move it out the way. Yes, indigenous people, let's praise them, let's be thankful for them, let's pray for them, everything. I'm all for it, like, I don't care. So, I'm all for this season of like, new traditions, you know, Forgetting the education that we kind of have like been grown up to believe and starting to believe the truth Like the actual aftermath of like what's going on in this world. So I just I really like it. You know, I really like it I really like the truth coming out. It's really different. It's really nice I like living in a world where like we don't we, we're not lied to about our own history Isn't that crazy? <laughs> What I mean, I mean, I'm black. They've been lying to me and my people about our history our whole entire lives. But look at us now, educated, oh, smart, empowered. Feels different, doesn't it? <laughs> so for our look today, I want to do something orange. I'm going to go into this Morphe palette, and I'm gonna try to use the oranges in this palette. So while I do this, guys, do you remember your first memory of Halloween? The other day I was trying to film a video and halfway in I was like, I gotta talk about this. So, you know, even though I'm making this video about fall, Halloween, I hate Halloween. I hate, hate, hate Halloween. I think that every experience with Halloween that I've had has just been awful. Um, I am not, and that's like, let me not like take you through a therapy moment right now. I just, I don't like scary things. I don't like to go on netflix and then go watch something scary and then like just mess up my spirit you know what i mean like i i i get it like the whole oh i'm scared <laughs> i don't know i don't get it i really don't get it but i get other people like that and it's just like the point of the matter is that this year at my school they did a haunted house i was six years old and again, I'm not such a Halloween person. Like, even my mom hates Halloween. Like, she doesn't like to be scared or anything. I remember, like, at school, I saw them, like, preparing the haunted house. So I was preparing my mind. I was like, you know, when we come back tonight, my mom and I are going to do the haunted house together. I just know that we're going to do it. So I'm not going to be scared. I was mentally preparing myself. I was like, I see them working on it. not every day but i see them setting up so i'm like i'm mentally preparing myself like i will not be scared because i know everything in there well so we're waiting in line unfortunately for me again i had a crush on a senior granted i was six years old that's a problem i was 
I had a crush on a boy who was a senior then, right? And he was in line. And um, okay, I had a crush on him because he looked like that biracial boy from um, High School Musical. You know, the one with the big afro and his hair was all bouncy. That's what he looked like. Come on. So he was going in. I was like, oh my God, if he can do it, like I can do it. <laughs> Every time they let someone in, they open the door, you feel the AC, you're like, oh my god, it's getting closer. And then every time they open the door, oh, 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 oh. I'm like, who, they, who are they trying to scare, okay? I'm scared. <laughs> Fast forward, we go into this haunted house and your girl is scared. First of all, I was supposed to be holding hands with my mom to like, so I don't like, you know, cry or get scared. I think I left my mom. I think she was holding my foot <laughs> and I was kind of like, I'm just going to speed through this. So I was really trying to run through the haunted house. But, you know, you can't do that because people are in front of you. And then, you know, people are hoo hoo ha ha. So I'm the kind of person I go into the haunted house and I will fight you. You know, if you come boo me, para. <laughs> I was the kid I was, okay? I will beat you. And then I remember I would hear people like, ow, that hurt. Why are you scaring me? When we got out, like I ran out, I, I ran out crying of that haunted house. I was just like, the Lord does not live in there. <laughs> Behold, my mom comes up to me. She was like, Priya, you were going so fast. I lost my purse in there. I said, I don't know why she's telling me this. <laughs> Is she trying to tell me we gotta go back? I was like, no, you're going alone, honey. Since you're going alone, I'm not going back in there. To do what? Find your purse with the monsters? Mm -hmm. I think she knew, she was like, this was a moment when she was like, my daughter is really useless. So she went back in, she got her purse. I think the teachers and the judges, they felt really bad for my mom. I think they were just like, this poor lady has to like deal with this girl on a daily basis. That year, I won that year's costume <laughs> contest. Yeah. They really felt bad for me. I took that prize with pride, okay? I, I took it with my chest. I said, give it here. I won a cheese burger with fries and a coke let me tell you i love food so that was good enough for me let me tell you what when i found out what my prize was i said next year it's on <laughs> next year i'm gonna cry it up <laughs> we'll say though i do still enjoy you know like halloween parties where we dress up as people characters whatever and then we just go to a party and then we get lit you know what i mean like that's all haunted houses and stuff like that stay away from me trick-or-treating i loved it more when i was able to trick-or-treat because i find it so unfair that like what you gotta be a certain age to trick-or-treat like we don't deserve candy well i don't really like candy that much as before but i really i enjoy candy i enjoy candy <laughs> i enjoy candy so guys by this point i was doing way too much with my eyeshadow i feel like i was spending way too much time so this is a little bit fast forwarded but yeah i'm bringing this old goodie back i'm gonna just put that in the middle here back with lashes on she's cute i'm just gonna go ahead and put primer on my face i've been loving this combo you know of the urban decay stay naked foundation i've been really loving this foundation and this primer has been doing really well This year, I think I'm going to participate in trick-or-treating, if that's still a thing. If it's not, then that's okay. But I mean participating, like I want to give kids candy. Oh, 
all right so for this part i want to use a blush that's gonna match the color like i want to use an orange blush i don't really have orange blushes but you know what we're gonna use eyeshadow because that's another trick that a lot of people don't know if you don't have um a blush color that you really like you can use eyeshadow even for your lips too mm -hmm. I'm going to be using this color right here. It's, it's like an orange. And if you feel like you lost a little bit of that contour from putting on the blush, go ahead and, you know, go back in with that contour. Don't ever feel scared to go back in like old products. I know in like these makeup videos, you guys kind of see like the perfection side of what we're kind of uploading on the internet. But just know that makeup is... Like a class like you have to learn you make mistakes is trial and error so don't be afraid to try new things eyeshadow on your you know on your cheeks on your lips if you don't have a color just try new things out don't be so stuck on like the things that you feel like people do if you feel like it's gonna work if you feel like you know it's gonna work out for your look try it out and see how you feel about it now if you don't like it then you know not to do it in the future but um you know just try things out you never know you might be teaching us a new trick soon okay so for today i'm going to be using the juvia's place um i think this is like from their warrior girl i don't know but it's called soil and it's matte it's like an orange color so i'm going to try to incorporate this on my lips and yeah but I'm really looking, liking this look. I feel like any other day, if I were to wear this out or to a party, I would wear it with super nude lips. You know the vibe. I always just do nude. But I want to try this orange out because why not? I wouldn't necessarily go for an orange lip, but like, I'm digging this. This is cute. Is this fall or Halloween? I don't know. Anyways, guys, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this look. Hope you enjoyed my little cute boring story about halloween anything whatever but i hope you guys enjoy the content um i actually really like this look let me know down below in the comments if you do enjoy this look if you like this orange if i should keep it orange or nude either way you try it out girl and you let me know what you did because she is cute i definitely like orange is new to me a pop of color on my lips is new to me but we are all about trying new things in the future it doesn't matter we're not gonna say next year we're not gonna wait until a whole next year to try things we're just gonna try new things so hope you guys enjoyed this look i hope you guys have a beautiful and amazing week ahead of you and until next time stay blessed